Good morning, y'all. Today is day two. Y'all, I do not feel like getting up out the bed. What's wrong with me? Somebody help! So, I went to bed like at 12.30 last night, even though I think I left off at like 11.30. I went to bed around 12.30. But I'm about to get my behind up. I have to meet with my professor in a couple of minutes. Well, like in an hour because it's like 10 o'clock right now, I think. I don't remember, but I have to check later. And I'm just going to get up, take a shower, brush my teeth, go baby. The breath. <laughs> but yes, yeah, so I'm about to just get up and just do the stuff that I need to do to get my behind, you know, ready and a little bit pumped for today. I think I'm going to try to start early with NCLEX reviewing. But my meeting today with my professor is technically about NCLEX. So I'll just... um I'm not going to show her face, but I can record the the actual meeting just by voice. But um if she starts talking about something personal, then I'll cut it off. But I think that'll be something good you guys could see. I don't, I'm not sure if everybody's professor does this, but this is supposed to be our last meeting for the school year. Yeah, so um, we'll see what happens. Um, she's very, very um, into like making sure we are getting out all of our NCLEX and stuff done. So our NCLEX preparation stuff done. So let me get up out this bed, y'all. I got up at 10 o'clock. I can believe this. This is late. This is getting up late, by the way, um, which which I'm okay with. You know, I'm not even complaining because I ain't got enough to do and um, no classes. So, um, uh, <laughs> all right, I'm too hype in the morning. All right, let me get up. trying to record and um getting um ready so i'm going to because my appointment is at 11 o'clock with my uh, professor and it's 10 50 and i don't want to be late i just kind of want to get it over with because i'm not sure I, I know this professor she talks a lot but this time i'm gonna try not to talk as much so once i get done with that then i'm gonna hit the shower then i'm gonna try to get um something to eat I'm not really a breakfast person, even though I love breakfast, I just don't like to eat it in the morning times, which sounds crazy, but that's just, that's just how I am. So I decided to sit here and talk to my professor. I know you guys know this is couch. It's in my background when I'm recording my videos. So this is where I'm gonna be seated and um, it's 10.55, so I'm about to just go ahead and just, you know, get ready for the conversation. I am up close and personal. You know Ooh. So I hope y'all are enjoying this content because, oh 
y'all. It's just too much. It's too much. Oh, not them having a restore. Everywhere you go. So, so last night I was. It's ten fifty nine. Look at me. I wouldn't be on there. She's gonna get on early. I know she is. But um, last night I was looking into um colleges, and we'll have to get into that later because um, obviously I am due for this meeting. Eleven o'clock a.m. I typically am on time, but trying to get up this, trying to set this camera up and everything, it was a struggle. All right, here we go. Open my browser. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Am I cute or what? <laughs> I know my hair look a mess, but you know what? It is what it is. Good morning. Good morning. How are you today? I'm great. How are you? <laughs> oh, I'm tired. It's almost the end of the week. I'm tired. Yeah. <laughs> you got one more day. That's right. And I did, um, on Monday, we did the mid hesse with 100 students. Oh, geez. Good luck yeah. with that. <laughs> I know. Those, those tests, they drain me. Yeah, really they take forever. Oh, my gosh. I, trust me, I know. I don't want no flashbacks. <laughs> no, no. You, you have to keep thinking NCLEX. Right. So, NCLEX, like, NCLEX, NCLEX. Your mind needs to be. Yes. <laughs> so, are you done with everything now? Yes. I've been done with all of my classes already. I just, this class was the only class that was left. So okay. yeah, and you registered with the board, fingerprints, <clears throat> yes. registered with Pierce, and all that's done. Yeah, so I already got my fingerprints done. The only thing is, I didn't, I can't see where I can go back and see if it actually came to the site. Okay. So when okay. I go into my so profile, can you I share. You can share your screen. Yeah. And you can take a look at that. Okay. Anything now? It's 150 questions. So if you did it today and reviewed it tomorrow, then just do two Q and A before you do Trainer Six, and you're still on track. Okay, yeah. Okay. okay, yeah. <clears throat> Everything you do, make sure you go back and review it. All your cue banks and mm -hmm. all your trainers. Yes. I've had some that have taken all of them, never reviewed anything, and then they fail because they didn't know where they were going wrong. Right. What's up, y'all? So I told y'all my professor, she talks a lot. I talk a lot too, so it didn't make it any better that we both talk a lot so it's 11 50 right now i'm just not getting off the phone with her but she's very intelligent and she just you know she gives really good advice now i'm about to go take a shower and i'm gonna eat and then i'll see you guys soon hey y'all so i decided to just take a little walk before i wash the dishes because <laughs> we got some dishes in the sink that i just have to get done or i won't be able to focus on studying so this is not me making excuses this time <laughs> But I do need to just take a walk. Oh, my camera. There we go. Take a little walk and just, you know, breathe, take in the fresh air, and get my heart pumping a little bit. Because, you know, I did just eat breakfast, and, you know, that can make you a little sluggish, even though I didn't eat anything too heavy. I just had some impossible meat and some grits. <laughs> um, I've been really craving grits, so. Yeah, that's why I ate. And I had a donut. <laughs> no judgment. So yeah, so that's what I'm doing. I'm just taking a little walk. Y'all, look at my skin, baby. Ooh, my skin is looking real nice. I got a nice little view over here. Yeah, so I'll see you guys soon. <sighs> What's up, y'all? So, it is... 9 20. as y'all know i am a look at me looking ratchet i just got cold but let me put this up a little bit <laughs> i am a night owl so i'm gonna probably be up studying late tonight so i plan on listening to mark k's lectures tonight um and i'm gonna start doing my hair at the same time so that way i'm getting two things done at once you know but um so I'm gonna listen to, I found 
the Mark K's um, lectures on YouTube. I already have the PDFs. I just needed to find the actual lectures. And then my plan is to at least, cause it's 15 videos and they're like an hour and a half to like two hours long a piece. So tonight I might do like four hours. So it's like two videos. And then, um, so pretty much whenever I get done with my hair is when I'll stop studying. So if it takes me six hours, whatever, however long it takes me to do my hair, which I don't think it's going to take that long. I'm only going to do some twists to my hair, something really simple. So I'm giving myself, I'm saying it's going to be about four hours of studying, which is not bad because I'm only going to be doing um, a few hours a day. I'm not going to be doing something, you know, super overboard. I'm going to open the door a little bit because it's kind of, um, there we go. It's a lot of echoing. So um, I talked to my professor today and she would not begin our grades in early because we have one person in our class that has not completed their assignments and um, we can't get our transcripts in when we're supposed to. Well, earlier. So that's holding everybody back from taking the NCLEX or just getting signed up. But it's fine, so it just gives me, because I wanted to take the exam in like two weeks, and it just gives me like like three or four more days afterwards, which is fine. So it won't be 14 days, I'd be like 17 days, which is okay. Um, and I'm not planning on studying two days before the exam anyways, maybe two or one day. I don't know, either one or two days. I just have to see. So you guys are following along with me. I don't know how it's gonna go. I'm just going with it and just showing you guys my journey and so you guys can see how it's like studying for NCLEX. Um, but yeah, so I haven't done anything today um, for NCLEX, but I will be doing that right now. Um, once again, this is the Mark K. Um, his last name is Klimek. I'm assuming that's how you pronounce it. K-L-I-M-E-K. -E and you can just YouTube that and then his lectures come up. I, um, let me see, I can show you. So I'm using these ones, the brown ones. And then once I, so my plan is this, so I'm gonna listen to the lectures, all of them, and then I'm gonna go back and listen to the lectures and uh, cause I'm gonna print out all the paperwork that I have. Um, if that's something you guys want me to send to you guys, I think I can do it. Let me just make sure it's not something that somebody can come back and like sue me for or whatever, then I'll be more than happy to link that down um, in the description box. If not, then I'll just tell you where you guys can find it, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. I have to figure it out. So so my plan is to listen to the lectures, go back and re-listen to them again with the actual paperwork, and then take notes. That's my way of doing it. I'm probably going to do that for three or four days, and then um, everything else will be practice questions. So since I know that this is like two hours per video it's probably gonna take me like five days probably this is probably gonna be the first week of what i'm gonna be doing and then i'll be throwing in the practice questions as well and then like in like throughout the day um i did make a calendar for myself however i haven't been following it um so i will be able to um show you guys how i set the calendar up it's very simple um, but I'm very, I'm a person that's really like, you know, do what I'm feeling like, because I feel like if I feel like doing it, then that's, I'm going to be the most successful when I'm doing it. So yes. All right. So let's just get down to business. Um, I'm going to start the first video. First video is on um, at sick base. Hi, Mark. Yeah, I'll be doing a review. And Linda Kane is now at the table. Uh, she she has a lot. She can answer any questions about logistics about the course. So um, she's best to ask on that. Uh, usually, if you have a question, I'll just refer you to her. So just go to her. She'll be here today and probably tomorrow. And probably. 
Hold on, y'all. So don't make fun of me in my hair because um, I have an addiction to cutting my hair. Um, I just really like short hair. And then every single time I'm just like, okay, I want to grow it out. It gets to a certain length and then I'm like, mm, it's too much. <laughs> So I am trying to grow it back out again. This time I must just I just want to see how long my hair can get. But overall, I really love short hair. Like if my hair was this short like like this, I would be perfectly okay. It's just easier to manage and I feel like my bone structure looks like my face looks better with short hair. But um that's just my opinion. So but yeah, so don't talk about me because I have my little baby plaits <laughs> in my hair and um, I'm going to be looking a little ratchet. So just a heads up. But I told you I'm keeping it real with y'all so y'all can see me, you know what I'm saying, with without the makeup and the hair I messed up. You know, just be real because this is what it is. So yeah, that's it. <laughs> Crazy still, but 
um, so they just went on a break and um, this first video was an hour and 30 minutes, excuse me, and 56 seconds. Well, technically an hour and 30 and like 40 seconds because the rest of this is just somebody who just forgot to stop recording. But um, this is a shirt, y'all. This is not a bra. But um, honestly, I am enjoying it. Like, I'm awake. Like, he is very funny. So he keeps everybody engaged. And although I don't have the paperwork in front of me, which I I know I, I have it, I kind of wish that I would have just did that first. But it's okay because I like to follow along with um, what they're saying, with, with what he's saying. And I feel like... He does a good job, like an amazing job, actually, of um, explaining um, and just getting, like, more so of, like, test taking and then, like, how to remember certain stuff. So, I feel like it's going to be beneficial because it's, like, some of the stuff, like, I already know, but it's a review and we have to remember that you're not learning, relearning everything. You're only reviewing it. So, um yeah, so far so good. So, um, I did take a break. Well, not necessarily. I didn't take a break. Break. I just um, went and got my charger. So I stopped a couple times. Like I stopped to use the restroom. Did I use the restroom? Oh, I. I don't know. I stopped to do something. I don't remember. But it was only for like a quick second, and then I had to stop to go get my charger because my computer was dying. And that's it. So I haven't really taken a break, but I had. <laughs> If you guys want to see my hair, I started my hair over like 10 times because I didn't know exactly what I wanted to do. So I ended up just going with like just twists. Um, once I'm done, I'll let you guys see, but nothing to it. So I'm about to start on the second video and I'll let you guys know what I feel about it. The first video was about exit um, and ba exit base balances and it was phenomenal. Um, definitely something I could really listen to. The time definitely went by fast because he was very engaging, like I said. And um, I don't know. It, I, I already feel a little bit more confident about taking the A class just based off this one video. And it's crazy to say that because um, I was, the more I talked about the A class, the more nervous I got because I felt like I wasn't motivated enough to start um, actually studying. But the lecture so far has me very pumped and just ready to learn more. So yeah, so I'm going to be headed to the next video and I'll see you guys in the next clip. All right, y'all. So I have made it to, I guess I'm being very transparent with y'all. So I did 55 minutes. It's 100 and, not 100, look at me. It's time for me to go to sleep. Um, it's an hour and 41 minutes long. So I still have like an hour and like 25, 26 minutes left. And um, wait. Yeah, like an hour and like 26 minutes left. So I run out of hair. So I'm just gonna listen to it. Um, I'm gonna continue to listen. I am sleepy. I see my eyes are getting red. So um, I'm gonna just continue to listen to it while I clean up. And then I'm gonna head out. So in this video is talking about alcohol, alcoholism, she's I think, Okay, see, this is how you know I'm sleepy. So it's talking about alcoholism, um, delirium, tremors, and it's not Alzheimer's, but um, amnesia. There we go. Um, but it didn't get to like the delirium slash tremors part yet, just more based on amnesia and then like alcoholism and like abuse in general. And it's been pretty good. Like, like I said, he's very engaging and I can focus. I can understand him and I'm answering the questions as if because he's, he's teaching um, well, reviewing and he's asking the class questions. So I'm answering back as if I'm in class because that's the way that I learn. Um, I like to talk and communicate. And so I feel like that's been helping me. But I definitely, definitely, definitely can't wait to sit down and um, go over the paperwork because he has a book. I didn't buy the book. So, but I'm not sure if the lectures that I have correlate like with the fill in the blanks as what he's going over. But I know I already checked to make sure that all of the paperwork, like the titles 
all matched, but I didn't look over it to see if it has like fill in the blanks or anything like that, or if they already have been filled in. So that's something that I will look um, into tomorrow. Excuse me. But um, yeah, so I'm definitely excited. Um, it's, it's been very, very good so far. Um, I hope you guys are enjoying my little series. Um, if you are about to take the NCLEX, man, kudos to you. I'm very proud of you just for taking that step for finishing nursing school. Um, this is a big deal and, you know, we have to take it serious. But I did want to just say, like, even though, like, I didn't do anything the first day, I'm going to do the second day. Like, you, if you don't feel like doing it, I'm not telling you to get completely lazy, but don't be hard on yourself, you know, just um be real with yourself and don't be in denial which is what we just like to talk about like you know confront the situation and then trying to change it so once you confront it change it and then you'll have a better outcome so i confronted myself last night even though i didn't do anything at all yesterday but i still was able to relax and you know i had some wine so i was feeling good yesterday and then today i was very energetic i got up i made my bed you know you guys seen the video so i was in a i was in good spirits um i was able to do my hair and also listen to the lecture so it's like you have to do something that helps you and motivates you and you know encourages encourages you to continue to um do what you have to do to get where you want to be and so and that's taking the ink legs so um i'm gonna end the video out here um i really appreciate you guys for your support and watching go ahead guys subscribe to my channel um i am doing better with my videos so i just want you guys to like it and share my videos to your friends to just to, to share it to your social media pages and you know tell people about my page so that they can get more information and also um, just have some type of support system for me um, and we can build a community here you know so they have support system for you too so to, to know that we're all going through this together so um, yeah so I would really appreciate if you guys could do that for me um, I really appreciate you guys once again um, and I'll see you guys in the next video good night